another claim um, made in Andrew Johnson's video is that if you go to Judy Wood's RFC, um, which we can find here, I downloaded this myself um, just to make it a bit quicker. Um, one of the things stipulated on Judy Wood's website, and we'll just have a look, Judy Wood's website, Journal of 9-11 Research and 9-11 Issues, uh, we, we see things like the key evidence videos, Judy Wood and John Hutchison, John Hutchison, the Hutchison effect, uh, Hurricane Erin news, okay, I'm sure everybody knows the Hutchison effect and Hurricane Erin are two of the main parts of the body of evidence that Judy Wood and Andrew Johnson uh, rely upon in their own theory. So let's check the evidence. We'll go to Judy Wood's PDF. This is Judy Wood's PDF that you can download from the NIST website. Uh, well, from the, the uh, website that includes all the requests for, uh, requests for the correction of information. Now then, if we, we've unticked whole words only, so that's okay. Hutchison effect, you just see here that it is indeed Judy Wood's request for correction. There it is. Now if we search Hutchison effect, no instances. Hmm, interesting. If uh, Judy Wood was so confident that the Hutchison effect played a major part on the destruction of the World Trade Center, why has, hasn't she included it in her own research? Let's try another uh, search, this time for um, Hurricane Erin. Just want to come closer. Hurricane Erin. Search. No instances. Hmm. Very interesting. Just as Andrew Johnson claims that thermite isn't included in the original RFC by Stephen Jones, even though it is, Hurricane Erin and the Hutchison effect, two of the main parts of Judy Wood's theory, are not included in her own RFC. Very interesting. What does it mean? Who knows? So, just to conclude, the RFC, which Andrew Johnson isn't, uh, is thermite free, isn't thermite free. And all you have to do is untick one of the search criteria. You will find this link. You can check it for yourself. You'll find this link if you untick whole words only. There it is. Click on the link and it will take you to Stephen E. Jones's peer-reviewed paper which mentions molten metal 45 times and thermite 57. So I'd just like to conclude by saying that this video is a request for correction to Andrew Johnson to correct his research and um, correct the title of his video RFC thermite free because the RFC isn't thermite free it just depends on your own search criteria okay remember always check the evidence and also remember that if somebody tells you that Jews brought down the Twin Towers on 9-11 you don't necessarily have to ring the ADL thanks for watching